is an interesting idea. Next time you're getting ready to go to a workout class, you may not have to leave your dog at home. You can bring your dog <laughs> with you, huh? Our web producer, Alexander Bahu, has more on a new exercise trend that's raising some eyebrows and tails. Relax your neck. You don't want any tension in the neck. We want to work those delts. When you're looking to shed off that extra weight, sometimes you have to work like a dog. Or maybe just with your dog. So you're doing a lateral lunge as you're trying to get your dog on and off the disc. A new exercise class is promoting fitness for both you and your pooch. You're getting the best of both worlds. You're getting a dog trained. You're burning calories. You're working out together. Uh, so I just thought it was a, a great idea. It's, it's called the, Bark and Burn. Stay. And at Wagon Tails in Shelby Township, dogs work their little muscles alongside their owners using equipment specifically designed for them. As the, the class moves on and as the weeks build and they start to, to build and um, up their um, endurance the same way that a human would, um, you see them jumping up onto the equipment and, and, and holding their, their balance and you can see the look on their face like, just leave me, <laughs> you know, like, look at me, I'm doing it. Organizers of the Bark and Burn say that one of the benefits of working out with your dog is that they kind of keep you motivated. What's that, Missy? Ten more squats? All right, let's do this. One. Two. Because they're fussing kind of with the dog, and so as they're doing some of these exercises, they don't even realize that they're working out. Similar doggy workout classes have popped up across the nation. Wagon Tails says that they are one of the first places in Michigan to pick up on the trend. At the end of these hour-long sessions, it's easy to see that the pups and their owners are pooped. She heads for a little couch and she sleeps. <laughs> You can tell she's tired. I guess you could call it a rough workout. Reporting from Shelby Township, that's I'm good, Alexandra Bahu, 7 Action News. Would you work out with your dog? Well, my dog will only move for a biscuit, so no. Too many <laughs> dog, uh, what, doggy bags for him, I guess? He's yeah. a little, yeah. No, so he just no, kind of lay so down much. on the job and eat He a does. He's a dog. What's he going to do? He's there just hanging out. Now, if Mine you would, wouldn't either. If you would like to learn more about Bark and Burn, check the story out on our webpage at uh, WXYZ.com. We have yeah. all that there. Cute idea. Why not?